everyone, Rashmi here. Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to tell you how to create a very simple project and that too on Scratch. We're going to click on our Scratch web page and click on create. The project we're going to make is going to be a name animation where you can animate your name the way you like it. Once you open our project, the Scratch cat is waiting over here. And for the name animation, as you know, we'll need the letters of our name. You can choose the same character, means the sprite, because they're different types, like tree types. I'm going to choose the same, because it will be easier for me as well. I can also decorate them my way. Mm hmm. Yeah, and just two more remaining. Okay, I'm going to click on Scratch Cat and I am going to click with the delete button on top. I'm going to delete it. And first of all, I need to arrange my letter. You can choose any backdrop that you like. And for now, I'm just going to do like this. And I will choose a backdrop, which is going to be, um, let's check out music. It can be a spotlight. It can be a theater. Oh, theater looks good. Yeah, I'm going to make a theater. So now, we can, you can change the costume by going in the costume tab, then coloring it like this. Which I will be doing later. So now for R, when this sprite is going to be clicked, it is going to rotate 15 degree and back again. We're going to the control tab and we're going to repeat both of them 10 times. Now, when we click on R, it's rotating 10 like this. For A, when this part is going to be clicked, the sound and play meow until then, uh, we can check out the sounds tab for pop. There we go. We can choose this and play sound pop until done. And for S, when this part is going to be clicked, we're going to make it hide and show. Show and hide. And then again, we're going to show it again. Mm -hmm. Then we don't need this one. So we're going to go in control and we're going to repeat. Like hide. And again, we're going to repeat it and so let's check it out. Mm -hmm. Why is there double? Or the, why is there double? Oh wait, never mind. Yeah. So I'm gonna run this and it won't run. So there's a error with the code. I'm just gonna make it glide to a random position. So first from glide one sec to a random position and then back again here. And that we're going to add a 0 0.5 seconds wait. And when this part is going to click, right, it's gonna go to a random position and come back. Random position, come back. Random position, come back. Now for H. For H, when this part is going to be clicked, we can hide it. Yeah, it's hide. It hid. Now we're going to wait for 0 0.5 seconds and show it. Show it again. There we go. Now we're going to run it.
there we go now for um when this sprite is going to be great we can maybe move to a specific one or we can do a random position we can change the color effect by 25 you can do fisheye world pixelate mosaic brightness or ghost but for now i'll do color okay but and for this i am going to gonna make it repeat okay now for i for i when this part is going to be clicked we can change the size by 10. we can change the size by 10 and then change size by minus 10. i'm gonna go to our control we're gonna repeat this 10 times and repeat this 10 times i do let's take a look it's like heartbeat da -da, da -da, da -da. um okay we're gonna make it to the normal size 100 yeah so size by 10 and back again size by 10 and back again now we can start adding our colors i'm just gonna choose a random color from here get the bucket and start filling it random color from here get the bucket and start filling it oh it looks something like ours so i'm just gonna change it a little bit yeah this looks better get the bucket pick a random color and change it get the bucket pick a random color and change it i'm gonna go for pink for m we can do um it will already be changing color so i don't think there's need to change color too for i it's already color so now we are done with our project we can add backdrop now if you want to we can add background noise if you want by clicking on this stage the backdrops i don't know there is no stage selected so it's a no motion box so when green flag is going to be clicked i'm gonna go check out a sound we can go in the effects tab and the loops tab and choose any one of them i'm gonna choose chill it's nice and relaxing so i'm gonna play sound chill until done and plus i'm gonna put it in a repeat block or maybe a forever block yeah actually repeat is better not sure if you can hear the sound but yeah now we're going to name our project the name animation and we're going to click on this orange button called share there we go i'm gonna name it so i'm just gonna write just press the letters so the letters from this the letters from the scratch library i'm gonna add it because it's letters and sounds from the sounds library so this is done and it's already shared i'm gonna add a comment wow so cool and click on this blue button called post there we go our project is done so guys thank you so much for watching this video don't forget to like subscribe sh hit the bell button and share this video with your family and friends i'll see you next time bye